Good morning, Sycamore. It's Monday morning. I hope you all had a lovely weekend. It was quite sunny, so I hope you had some nice time outside as well. We're going to start today with our phonics lesson. And today, your phonics words that you're going to learn this morning are the same as the spelling words I've given you. They've got the same letter sound, the er uh sound, but they're not all spelt in the same way because the er uh sound, the a uh and the r, uh, the er, uh, can be spelt in different ways. So we're going to start by looking at words that are spelt with the u r, with the er uh sound. So I'm going to say the word and then I'm going to count to three and you're going to say the word. So let's make a start. Here's our first one. Burger. One, two, three. Well done. Burger. And there's the er. Uh, and there's the er. Uh, two letters. U R. So it sounds like er uh, and it's spelt er. Uh. Here's our second one. Church. I say it. One, two, three. Church. Well done. Here's the next one. Oh, I have to make myself a bit smaller or you won't be able to read it. There we go. Churn, the milk churn. One, two, three, your turn. Churn, well done. I can make myself a bit bigger now so you can see me. Curl, the girl has got a curl in her hair. One, two, three, your turn. Curl, well done. Fur, she had fur on her raincoat. One, two, three, your turn. Fur, well done. Oh, this is quite a tricky word. Hurl, I wonder if anyone knows what that means. Hurl, one, two, three, you say it. Hurl, Mr. Babington will know what this means. You hurl a ball, you'll throw it, you hurl something. Make myself a bit smaller again so you can see this word. One, two, three. Nurse, your turn. One, two, three. Yeah, and our nurses are doing such a super job at the moment. Here's our next word. Purse. One, two, three. Your turn. Purse. Well done. Where you can keep all of your money. Here's the next word. Turban. One, two, three. Well done. He wore a turban on his head. Turn. You can turn round. One, two, three. Your turn. No, oh, your turn. I think you probably all got that one right. Turn it. One, two, three. That's right, turnip. Now a turnip is not a fruit. A turnip is a vegetable. Some of you might even be growing them in your gardens. The next word. Turtle. Turtle. One, two, three. Your turn. Turtle. Looks like that turtle's just come out of the sea. Right. I R letters. Now these words are spelt with the I R letter, but they make the er uh sound. So let's try these. Bird. One, two, three. Well done. Remember, you can use your Fred fingers. B er uh, d bird. Here's the next one. Oh, we all love this. I do anyway, I think you do as well. Birthday, one, two, three. Birthday, and we've had a few birthdays while we've been doing our home learning. There's quite a few children in Sycamore who've had their birthdays while they've been at home. Here's the next word. Circle, one, two, three. Circle, well done. And we did use circles for our two dimensional shapes. Circus. One, two, three. Well done. Circus. I wonder if any of you have been to a circus and seen any clowns. 
dirt. One, two, three. Dirt. A little boy being playing football and he got dirt all over his shirt. Very similar. Dirty. D uh, t e. The Y says E. Dirty. You say it. One, two, three. Well done. Little boy had a very dirty shirt. Fur. One, two, three. Well done. Like a big fir tree, a big fir Christmas tree. They're fir trees. First. One, two, three. First. Miss Tate came first in the race. She probably didn't, but I'd like to think I could. Here's the next word. Girl. One, two, three. Girl. The girl had two bunches in her hair. Girl. It's the next word. Ladybird. One, two, three. Ladybird. You'd think that could be two words, but it's all one word. There's no spaces. Ladybird. Sir. Sir. One, two, three. Sir, sir or madam? Would sir or madam like a cup of tea? It's a question. Shirt, one, two, three. Shirt. The man was wearing a blue shirt. Skirt, 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 one, two, three. Well done. The lady was wearing an orange skirt. Squirt, squ, squirt. You try it. One, two, three. Well done. The little girl squirted the water. Well, the water came out in a squirt. Stir. One, two, three. Stir. I like to stir the cooking pot. There's a whir, 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 whirl, whirl, whirl. One, two, three. Whirl. You whirl round and round and round and round. Third. One, two, three. Third. The little boy wearing the yellow vest and blue shorts came third. I used some adjectives in that sentence. I wonder if you spotted what they were. The yellow vest and the blue shorts. Thirsty. One, two, three. Well done. It was a hot day and I was very thirsty. Th th thirty. There's the number. Thirty. One, two, three. The lady had her, her birthday. She was thirty. And that's the end of our er uh words. So you can spell them in two different ways, either with the uh and the r or the i and the r. Now you've watched this, you can have a look at your spellings for this week. And you can have a practice. Your literary lesson today is to have a little look and practice writing your spellings. So now we've done these, that should be a little bit easier. So I'm going to see you a bit later for your maths lesson. Bye bye. See you later.